This is the Rising OS 5.0 final version and yes the features which I missed in the previous video are actually included here. This custom room always brings you some new things by the way this is kind of a similar custom room sign kind of a similar update which I made video already two or three days ago but the features which I missed actually the features which were not available that time now it's there and this is the final update and i guess the new update will be the different version and the thing is what i found after installing rising OS on my device after installing it on my pixel 7a it's quite good the fingerprint sensor speed is so smooth right now it's so fast now and also the animations are so good looking the autos launcher is good enough things are quite improved and also for now after using it for some time maybe it's quite good quite stable one of the things which you have to keep in mind is boot animation i have shared with you in my previous update the boot animation styles are included here but with this update which is a final version now you will get some preview which is a very good thing the cyberpunk style which i have shared i have shared with you in my previous video i've talked about that google kind of boot animation which is similar to google the google gemini boot animation the normal google monet boot animation this one is also there which was already there but including all these boot animation one of the main highlights of this one is you can also apply some custom boot animations remember i share some boot animations with you on my other channel so this is the time if you if you use rising os then you can definitely check out those custom boot animations and apply it directly from your storage this could be a very interesting thing very useful thing in case you use rising os check this out and by the way it's also available unofficially for some of the devices so it's a very good thing it's not a private or closed source custom room that's a good thing one of the things which I missed in the previous video also was backup personalization settings and in my opinion this is one of the best features. I remember when I last used this feature it was in some other custom room. What basically it does is like if you are using the most customizable custom room you even don't know you forget something like which are the customizations you have enabled. So in that case you can take the backup of all the things could be a very useful thing for you. The basic call recorder is also pre-included with this new update which is a very useful thing. In my case, I am having Google Dialer pre-installed. So definitely if I want to record calls, that would be a very headache for me. But yes, BCR which is basic call recorder. It's already there. By default, if you want to use this basic call recorder, you have to root your device. But after installing Rising OS because it's already there in bit, it's a very, very useful thing. And of course, one of the main highlights was this bootloader spoofing. Let me show you. This is the app which you can also install from Google Play Store for free. As you can see, my bootloader is detected as bootloader is locked. It's spoofed as locked. And yes, this is so amazing. And I guess this could be useful for a lot of you. I'm not exactly sure, although it's there and definitely I missed it in my previous video. So the main features and more and more features which you have in Rising OS, definitely it's just so amazing. And that is why you, you just can't miss, you, you can't deny to use Rising OS on your device. You have to check this one and Rising OS 5.0, the final version which I'm using right now, it is also quite stable. That is also one of the advantages that this custom room is now quite stable. It's not beta anymore. It's quite stable. It is having all the spoofing options. No more issues with the play integrity because the play integrity fix is already inbuilt in the spoofing section including these spoofing options by the way this enable gms spoof option is actually useful it's necessary to pass bootloader checks in case if you're wondering about that the security options are there by the way i found some of the things were actually not working like the hide ime space option that is a bug from a long time so i just hope that will be fixed anytime soon but yes these are the things available there if you want to try this custom room on a device, you can. Link is already there in the description for all the supported official supported devices. And if your device does not have the official version support, you can check out your device community groups on Telegram if it is working definitely for sure. And again, you can also check out the XTA channels for your device. If you have any unofficial version, you can check that. Yes, these were the things I just wanted to let you know. This was all. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this video. Don't forget to like and share this one. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.